Hey, did you watch? Um, uh, this just came to me. Uh, oh God, I'm gonna forget what it's called, but it's a documentary about American Gladiators. That's just. I, uh, I didn't. I didn't. I didn't see the Netflix one, but I saw the Thirty for Thirty. No, there's a there's a Netflix like a multi. I know the Thirty episode. for Thirty is is pretty damn good because it it goes mo- more into the guy that created it, the guy that was the Elvis impersonator. Yes. Yeah, it goes more into him. I was gonna watch the one. Um, that was on Netflix, but when it started, um, it was it was pretty. It was kind of covering stuff I had already seen. But give the American Gladiators a shot because they what they start to do is I didn't see the thirty for thirty. No, I'll, I'll watch it. I'll it's watch more it. about the the guys and and the girls that were the. They uh, got hosed. Athletes. Yeah. Oh, they got hosed, man! Like the thirty for thirty that I watched. Like they were doing, like they were running, like we were. Three, I mean, they were in buses doing tours. And yeah, live event. I mean, it was, and it was uh, in the beginning wildly unsafe. I mean, they gave no consideration oh. to protecting anybody. Really, they just oh. come up with an idea for a game and just try oh. it. Yeah, yeah. You guys, re- they have the contestant run by, and the gladiators will throw axes at them. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, let's, let's give it a shot. See what happens. <laughs> um, official fingers, MC. I genuinely think I could have carried on smoking weed. Got diagnosed with temporal lobe epilepsy, so weed messes my head up. I wouldn't have battled alcohol and heroin addiction for 21 years of my life. I'm clean of any drugs now, but I do enjoy a cheeky God pint you, brother. when I'm out with the missus. Keep up the good work, fellas. Be- best podcast around. Yeah, ha- had that. Uh, THC stigma never been there and people just had a joint as a fucking alternative legally who knows what people wouldn't have yeah they always called it a gateway drug when I was a kid you know they're talking about well pot you may think you're just smoking a joint with your friends but that's a gateway drug and they said it exactly like that all with yeah, the Tales yeah, from because, the Dark Side theme behind them because everybody knows that if you get stoned and you enjoy that feeling, you go right to heroin. I mean, no, you go right. To, you go right to cocaine. Oh, <laughs> because the, it, the, yeah, yeah, <laughs> you know, it, because that's why. Like, wow, man, listen to listen to that guitar solo. I'm sorry, I can't. I'm grinding my teeth over here. Like, oh man, come on. That's yeah, like I, I used to always say. Like, my I, like like dudes would be like, man, what, what what kind of music do you like? And I'd be like. Well, like, you know, like Isley Brothers, you know, you know, some Jeffrey Osborne, like, like, like you know, we, you know, back in the day, a little Taste of Honey, little Barquets, you know, and they'd be like, why do you, th- I don't understand, like, uh, wait, I'm like, well, don't you, like, you make love, right? Like, you listen to music when you make love. Like, that's, like, the time when it's the most important is when, you, you know, I said, I'm sorry, man, but I just can't see myself like throwing down the slipknot, <laughs> you know. <laughs> Especially not it. It's not that and I love Cortez. I mean, no, Stone Sour. Yeah, I, I probably probably rock one with some Stone Sour. But if I'm she sorry, puts man. it on, you're in for it. Well, and, and thank you for the make love, by the way. Get, get, keeping in mind uh, YouTube's uh, restrictive policies, so I want to I want to thank. Hey, you I'm, I'm, I'm trying tonight. I'm love. trying tonight. 